The drugs are flooding into the Susquehanna Valley. Investigators estimate there's more than a million dollars worth of heroin in one county alone right now. Newsday's Caitlin Smith gives us an inside look at the amount of drugs coming into our community every day. The smell of marijuana hits you right away. It's just the cabinets, cabinets, all the boxes. Representing only some of the busts the Lancaster County Drug Task Force has made. We've outgrown a room uh, that was solely for that. The task force says dozens, if not hundreds of people from Lancaster County travel to Philadelphia every day to bring home heroin. Back in the 80s, if we caught a dealer with, say, you know, a tenth of this, that was that was a big bust. Now it's a typical bust, 4,000 bags of heroin, and in the same day it's brought back, it could be gone. He says even if you don't know a single dealer. You could leave here and probably probably within a half an hour you could have purchased heroin, I'm sure. And because demand is so high, many are buying in bulk. Like this. So even when police do make what they consider a big bust. You would like to think that when we got this, this would have put a huge dent in heroin distribution in the county. And it did not. After each case is closed, Lancaster County then burns the drugs. You can see all of these boxes here are filled with bags like this, and each one of these bags is filled with drugs. And you can see all the boxes here. This is just from January. It just can't, it can't be stopped. But that isn't stopping investigators from trying. Caitlin Smith, News 8.